Hi, I'm Mike, M Kitchen Chef here at Morrison's. Now we all love scones, traditional British treats, perfect for summer parties, perfect for Wimbledon. But the scones I'm going to show you today have a delicious savoury twist with British cheddar and tomato jam. Mm. Okay, to make our scones, we're putting the cheese into my mixing bowl first, like so. And now I'll sift my flour, my mustard powder, and my baking powder all together and onto my cheese. By sieving your flour and your mustard powder and your, your dry ingredients, you're adding air to the mix, and it's the air in the mix which makes the scone lighter. And now for the wet mix. I'm going to mix the milk, an egg, the oil, give it a little whisk, and I'm going to add the wet mix to the dry and gently fold it in. So once I've just folded it in, I'm going to bring it together with my hands. And don't worry if the mix is a little bit wet, because this will give you a really light, fluffy scone. So this is perfect. Okay, so now I've got my dough where I want it to be, which is nice and soft and sticky. I'm going to lightly flour my working surface and my hands. And I'll tip out the dough onto that floured surface and gently pat it down with my hands until it's about an inch thick. And there we have it. Perfect scone base. Now, I'm going to cut it with my scone cutter onto my baking tray. A quick glaze of milk. To get that lovely golden brown finish. And now, our scones into the oven, 200 degrees C, until you can smell them. Or they've risen to about twice the size. So now to make our tomato jam. And to start with, we're going to skin the tomatoes. I'm going to cut a small V on the back of the tomato. Place that in a bowl. Same with that. And same with that one. And place them in the bowl and cover them with boiling water. I'm going to leave that for about a minute and then the skins will just peel off. So once the tomato has been immersed in boiling water for a few minutes and you can put your fingers in, take the tomato out, peel off the skin. Easy as that. And for our tomato jam, using our peeled chopped tomatoes into the pan, outside of vinegar, brown sugar, chopped onions, mustard seeds, three tablespoons of tomato puree, and not forgetting the salt, season. Now we'll give it a good stir. So we're just getting all these ingredients mixing together and melding to get that flavour working. The vinegars and the sugars, the tomatoes, the mustard seeds. And now bring that to a simmer and simmer it for two hours. Beautiful. And to serve our scone, simply cut it in half. A dollar of our tomato jam. And a beautiful combination, cheese, tomato jam scone.